Hello friends, today I'm going to solve little problem number 14, longest common prefix. So in this problem, we are given an array of strings and we need to find the longest common prefix among all of these strings. So what's prefix? So basically prefix is any character that's appearing before um, uh, starting from the index zero. So FL is a prefix of flower, okay? And similarly, FLOW is also a prefix of flower. And flower is itself a prefix of this whole word, okay? So now we are going to find the common prefix of all of these words. So what's common in all of these words? F, L, O, W is common between these two words, right? And in among, so we found the common between these two words. Now, is F, L, O, W common to these also? No. It's only F and L, which is the prefix is common to um, all of these words, right? So that's our result. So basically, how are we going to find this solution? So let's just look at this example. I'm going to draw, use this drawing tool to help you. So what are we going to do is basically we want to start looking from the very first and find the prefix and... Uh, keep on finding our common prefix so first we will assume we'll start from the first word and we'll assume that that's our common prefix so f l o w e r is our common prefix and we we use this common prefix to compare with the rest of the word and we keep on updating our prefix so we compare flower this common prefix with our first word which is flower and we still have this flower right so now we compare this with flow and as we are comparing we will start from the first character until and unless we have reached the character which is neither a match or we have reached the end of the word so here w is a match next when we move to the next index we do not have any other characters right we reach the end of the word so that is when we'll know that at index 3 up to index 3 we found our prefix right so now our common prefix becomes f l o w okay so f l o w is our common prefix now now using this as our common prefix we are going to now compare with the rest of this strings in this array so now in this string we start from the first character which is f so f is a match we move to the next which is l l is also match we now we move to the next which is i here and o over here since it is not a match what we know is now at index two we do not find our match so our match is up to f l so we update our prefix and now our prefix becomes f l now we again start comparing with the rest of the strings but since we have reached the end of our array we return our prefix which is the longest common prefix okay so that is how we are going to solve this so the time complexity is o of m times n because we are iterating once over each of the um, element in this string array and we are also iterating over each of the character of these words and m would be the maximum length of this string so in this array okay so that's our uh, time complexity and space complexity would be o of m because we would only be storing one string right so that would be o of m which should be the longest length length of the longest string okay so now we know how to solve this problem let's dive into our solution so to solve this we are going to uh, create our common prefix and let that be our first index okay now we are going to compare with rest of the strings so let's string of strings and we are also going to compare with the first string so here we are going to start from index i equals to zero and i'm just going to uh, use index i as our um uh as the block scope can be this outer for loop so that's why i am um uh, i'm defining it outside you'll just know you'll know in a while why i'm doing that so 
i should be less than the length of the string and i plus plus now we are going to compare if um, index i at of the string is less than the length of the prefix so if that's less than the length of the prefix and um, the character at index i in prefix is also equals to the character at of the string at index i so if that's the case uh, we are going to continue right continue else what are we going to do we found an unmatched character so that is where we are going to break uh, from our internal loop because we found the character where there is an unmatched right so here with flow and flight so we found at index 2 we found that there is an unmatch so that means our maximum uh, common longest prefix length is fl only so now so we break out of the loop and now we update our prefix which is equals to string the substring starting from index 0 and ending at index i and we are going to return our prefix over here and why am i using index i because here i would be at this index right and substring to take the substring i is um, non-inclusive so we'll only get index zero and one characters so let's now run this code and look at it awesome let's submit this so as I told, the time complexity is of m times n because once we are iterating over each of the strings and the next we are iterating over each of the character in the string. Awesome. I hope you like my solution. Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you.